Hello, this is your girl Physiology, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Make sure you like and subscribe. Make sure you click that notification button so you know exactly when I'm uploading new content. I'm on VU today, and I'm going to teach you guys how to make neon signs. So this is going to be in the furniture section. So this is why you see what you see here. You just type in neon sign. Now, a lot of people make their money from doing pictures, just like simple things, but I wanted to show you guys how to make a simple neon sign. Um, everyone's got creative on here, so, you know, as you guys can see how good everything looks. They have a lot of unique type of things here, but I'm going to show you guys how to make a different type of neon sign. Now, obviously, it's not going to be too complicated, because I'm not going to give you guys complicated things to create but this is just an example of another way to make credits on here a lot of people buy furniture for their houses i've seen people buy furniture for their mansions it usually takes a long time to fill up the mansions i i never actually understood the point of buying huge mansions if you're not going to actually utilize the house but a lot of people tend to buy furniture for a lot of things clubs and stuff like that parties baby showers whatever they do on here it, it, they just they just there's a need for it okay i actually have a couple neon signs in my place as well so let's get started i'm going to show you guys where i went to and who i'm deriving from so let's go i decided to derive from karma monks because her derivation fee isn't as high it's 379 credits if you want to just actually buy a sign but deriving from her is cheap now there are plenty of places that you could derive from not places but people that you could derive from that are probably cheaper but i didn't feel like looking too hard for that but you can definitely look hard if you want to get your money's worth but this is the sign here you can look at the product id down below or click derive from product so let me show you exactly what it looks like I'm back in VU and this is what the sign looks like now you guys need to pay close attention to the texture and the opacity map the opacity map is white as you can see usually it is white and that's what you want and the texture is the color that you want it to be so just keep that in mind and keep that in mind for GIMP when you open up GIMP you're going to be opening up 256 times 256 so remember that all right let's go into GIMP so I can show you guys okay we're in GIMP so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to click on file new Two fifty six, as I said before, times two fifty six, and this is what it looks like. You can color it black by clicking the paint bucket tool. Just I want to make sure, and then just there, it's black. Very simple, very easy, not too hard. Now I downloaded some neon signs that I actually liked and I'm gonna show you where I downloaded from so let's go take a look in Google so we're in Google and I typed in neon sign PNG I always type in PNG for a lot of things because I sometimes just be too lazy to you know take out the background myself but as you guys can see, they have a lot of neon signs. These are some examples. I actually really love this. But again, PNG tree is not free. So you cannot get that. But these are looking really nice. Now, what you will see in VU is a lot of the good vibes sign or, you know, stuff like that. Very simple stuff. You'll see like some name brands as well the open the close signs like just pretty much you see all this you'll see a lot of this in there but if you want to go for something different 
it's a good idea to do that. You want to stand out from other people. You don't want to go with what everyone else is doing. So you want to definitely look in BU and take your time looking at stuff that's not there. You see a lot of the lips and stuff like that. That does not need to be done again. There's plenty of these in there. So you, if you want to go with something different, go with something different. Like, I don't see a lot of neon signs when it comes to the horoscope. Like, different horoscopes. I don't see a lot of that. So maybe you might want to go with that route. Or you might not. You might want to go with food. I do see ice cream and popsicles, but I don't see actual food food like that um you know you get pretty much the same same old same stuff you want to go with something unique and different that's going to set you aside from everybody else so don't go for the same thing that everyone else has but i'm just showing y'all different stuff i don't even think they have a lot of uh baby showers neon signs either i don't think they have them at all so you might want to go with something different. A lot of people do have baby showers on there. So just think about that. Weddings, you know, like if you want to make your own custom signs or even make money having your own custom sign business, like you can actually do that. But these are kind of cool. The angel wings, that's really nice. Okay, so this is just an example of showing you guys where you can get the neon signs from. Top PNG is free. Nice PNG is free. Fly clip art is free. Like, a lot of these things that you want to download are free. You just have to look. PNG key is free as well. Alright, so let's get started. Let's go back into GIMP. We are back in GIMP. Now let's go. File. Open as layer. Go here. And I'm going to go to downloads. This is a neon light. Okay. So I'm going to have to scale this layer. Scale layer. Let's see. What should I do it as? 200? Just to see what it looks like in 200. It's still too big. <laughs> okay, so under layer scale. Hmm. Let's see. Let's see what sixty looks like. All right. So it's a guitar. Sixty. Maybe I should have did a hundred. Let me see. Let me go back. So layer scale. Hundred. See what that looks like. Oh, it's too big. I guess 60 was right on, huh? Let's do 70, actually. I just want to see more detail than that. Okay, 70. So I did a neon sign. It's, it's 70. And I have to change this color to white. So it, this will be pretty simple. Just color. Colorize. And pretty much just playing with the lightness. And okay. And I'm going to overwrite this file. Actually, I have to save it first. Save as mm, neon sign. JPG. I'm going to save it into my camera roll. Just take me to export dialog and export. Export and we're all set. So it's in my camera roll. Now let's see what it looks like in view. We're back in view. Now I'm going to click on this edit. sign I'm not gonna apply the changes yet actually you know what I am I'm gonna apply the changes Let me show you it's gonna be a blue guitar because I did not change this color guitar yet 
but there. And I'm going to save it. You see how simple that was? Now, obviously, I could change the color to anything I want it to be. But this is what the neon guitar looks like. So it's a neon sign. And this would look better in the dark. Or in like a nice club lounge type of area. But this is what the neon sign looks like. It's very simple to do. If you want to change the texture color, you can do that. It's very simple. But make sure you guys like and subscribe. Make sure you click that notification button so you know exactly when I'm uploading new content. Um, please subscribe. That would help me a lot. And if you have any questions or comments, please comment down below. I will get to you ASAP. Have a nice day.